NJB Assistant Commissioner of Police and the first Public Relations Officer of the Nigerian Police Force, First Headquarters Abuja. We, as a responsible, a responsive uh, civil organization, the Nigerian Police Force, we have deemed it necessary to address the issue of ECMR concerning vehicle registration and the likes. The Nigerian Police Force recently made a statement that we are suspending the enforcement of the process, not the ECMR itself anyway. The enforcement uh, policy has been suspended as directed by the Inspector General of Police of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Jibulu Karoli, Adiolu Ebetoko. And of course, it's for us to have that ample opportunity to engage Nigerians, to educate Nigerians, and to have proper sensitization of this particular process of the project. We know that Nigerians, we need them to cooperate with us, to collaborate with us, and for us to be on the same page while implementing this policy and embracing this particular electronic policing approach. And I want to speak on the advantages and benefits of the Nigeria Police Electronic Central Motor Registry, ECMR. In fulfilling its statutory obligations, especially with reference to motor vehicle administration, the Nigeria Police Force must have its own repository of vehicle information and vehicle ownership to be able to perform optimally. The beneficiaries of this particular application are vehicle owners, the state government via their motor licensing authorities, security and law enforcement agencies, the federal government of Nigeria and the nation, and of course, the general public. The advantages for each of these benef beneficiaries are as follows. For vehicle owners, one, vehicle owners are able to flag their vehicles when stolen and instantly trigger notification alerts to police stations, CMR enforcement officers, and patrol units nationwide for quick recovery. Two, no person can change vehicle ownership without the owner's consent. Three, a vehicle owner can monitor the status of his or vehicle online and print the certificate for any other transaction. No longer the need to carry paper documents as relevant vehicle information are available and accessible digitally on owners' electronic devices like phone, computer, etc. The effective implementation of the ECMR will discourage criminals from stealing vehicles going forward and gives vehicle owners peace of mind. The state government, via their motor licensing authority, will increase, help to increase a number of regularization of vehicle documents to create an enabling environment for the government to make and implement policies to curb road tax evasion. Reduction in motor licensing authorities operating costs, both human and financial, as it did not be necessary to chase vehicle owners to comply with regulations on vehicle registration. It enhances government and police collaboration on full enforcement of all laws, most especially on vehicular and traffic management. Now to the Nigeria Police Force. It helps Nigeria Police Force, of course, to support police investigation activities seamlessly. Secondly, instant verification of registration and ownership during traffic stops to ensure that vehicles are legally on the road. Reduce crime rates as usage of motor vehicles for the commission of crimes may decrease. Quick identification of vehicles involved in crimes or accidents leading to faster resolution of cases. Speedy recovery of stolen vehicles is facilitated and enhanced. The CMR Robust Database acts as a deterrent to potential car theft. And of course, ECMR is in total conformity with the IGP's digital policing agenda, as all steps, vis-a-vis -vis implementation and enforcement of this project is basically electronic. Also, the ECMR gives frontline enforcers real-time access to vehicles and vehicle owners' details for status check. The police leverage on the ECMR application 
the four special enforcement teams comprising police specialized and trained ICT experts to curb professional misconduct. Then, to security and law enforcement agencies, what can they benefit from this application? One, swift availability of vehicle information to support joint security operations is assured. The support operational and investigation activities of all security and law enforcement agencies across the country. Then to the general public, our people, let me say that this is going to benefit you as a Nigerian or a Nigerian resident. One, protect the possession motor vehicle buyer from purchasing a vehicle with any form of equivalence. Secondly, assurance that any incident affecting the citizens cost with the use of vehicles are properly resolved. Three, viable preventive measure against vehicular theft. Four, it prevents multiple registration of vehicles. Five, to prevent thieves from upgrading the physical features of any stolen vehicle. Six, it connects owner's personal identity to the vehicle. Seven, it avails owner's instance historical changes of the vehicle. Eight, it allows owners to electronically update features of their vehicles with police approval. Then to the federal government and the nation at large. Increased sanity on the roads as only properly registered vehicles are on the roads. Use of small good vehicles on the roads are prevented and smuggling discouraged. Improvement in national security through the security of citizens' vehicular assets. And at this point, I want to assure Nigerians that the police will continue to be responsive to yearnings and aspirations for an average Nigerian to make sure we have a perfect system, more secure environment, and of course, a productive system in Nigeria. Working with the police should be seen as a civic responsibility. A call from the Office of the Inspector General of Police is that one Nigerians to understand the plight and of course the ability of the Nigerian police force to think outside the box, embrace modern policing strategies to have more effective policing structure in Nigeria. We count on your support, we count on your understanding, and of course we hope we go to operate on the same page to make sure we have a safer society in Nigeria. Thank you and God bless you all.